what's up guys I'm here with another video and before I actually start this review I'm sorry if this video is a little rushed I just needed to get content out before the school year starts and I'm sorry if the video isn't as up to quality as my other reviews so I promised that there was going to be overwatch gameplay so there's not going to be overwatch gameplay anymore due to the fact that there was something wrong with the actual game and I had to send it back and I'm still waiting for it to come in so, I'll probably get some more Destiny gameplay instead. So, I'm probably going to bring out more content in the coming weeks. And, by the way, guys, thanks for 100 subscribers. I promise I'll do something for 100 subscribers. And, thank you guys for watching my videos. And, more videos will be coming in the coming weeks. So, thank you guys, and peace out, and enjoy the review. What's up guys, Sammy here in our video, and today we're going to check out the Jam Transit Touch Bluetooth wireless headphones. Now you can find these on Amazon for under 50 bucks, and yeah, let's check them out. So the Jam Transit Touch Bluetooth wireless headphones are some of the best headphones you could pick up for under 40 bucks. I was able to pick this up for about $38, and it's normally 100 bucks, but these sound really nice and fit really comfortably in the ear, and they also have good sound quality, and I'll do a sound test with these later. To power on the headphones, you need to hold this button down for about 5 seconds, and it's going to make a sound. And it's going to connect to your phone. If you already have it connected, just set it up as connecting. And the touch controls over here are really nice. So basically, you go forward for the first track, back for another track. And if you want to change the volume, you basically circle it around. As you can see, it's following my finger. It has multi-touch controls. You can go up, go down, side, side. And that's basically the touch controls. They're really, they're okay for basically like headphones. They're not Samsung level over quality. They're not basically, like they're not, this is an iPhone touchscreen quality. But it's really good. It's a really nice feature for the price. I was able to pick this up for about 30 bucks on Amazon. You can find it and it's probably the best price. But I don't think it's going to be there that long since they retail for about $100. And... I recommend you get these headphones as quickly as possible and the only problem I have with the headphones personally is the fact that it had well, the fact that like if you if you try to change the touch controls if you try to change the song that it's gonna make an annoying beeping sound and it can get annoying over time so yeah that's probably the only problem I have with these headphones but yeah and also the ear cups are really soft really leathery i don't think it's real leather it could be i don't know but it's synthetic leather i guess but it's really really comfortable they're over here at headphones and the sound quality is really really amazing it's not beats quality sound i'll tell you that but it's it's pretty good for the price you're getting this for these probably be these are probably these sound very closest to the Sony to the Sony Bluetooth headphones, well not that close, but sounds similar to the headphones and the sound quality is pretty amazing. So I'm going to show you that. And so the sound test is going to be a little different this time and basically what it's going to work, how it's going to work is that I'm going to put out as high as volume and see if the headphones can actually reach that high volume that I expect it to because it's a really... Even though it's like not that expensive, it has to have really loud. It has to be really loud, so that's how the sound test is gonna work. So I'm gonna use one of Lashawn Camry's beats. I'll give him a shout out. But thank you for letting me use your beats, and let's get into that's it. The beat I'm gonna use for the headphone test, and shout out again to Lashawn Camry. Thank you for letting me use your beat for the video. So here is I'm what it's. I'm gonna play the song at full volume, and let's test out the sound.
quality. These have really punchy bass. These won't, these are not completely overpowered by bass, but these have really nice bass. I remember I had these Jam Transit earbuds and they had like way too much bass. These have a clear enough sound. These are really clear in quality. And if you use these as a mic, they're really nice. The only bad thing is that you can, can't connect it to your gaming console. When I tried to connect it to my PS4, it won't work. That's the, the and the annoying sound that comes up when you're changing the controls and stuff. But it, but you'll probably get used to it. So thank you guys very much for watching this video. More videos will be coming soon, especially in August. My next video is going to be the HMDX Ray video review. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope to see you guys soon. Like, subscribe, and peace out.